everybody, welcome to day 96 of the 100 Day Projects Watching. Today I'm going to replicate Deep Sea Green, Corridum Deep Sea Green, which is a mixture of PG-18 and PB-29. And Let me just swatch this out and then. So I'm using Schmickerhardam Viridian and Schmickard and French Ultramarine and this is too much French Ultramarine isn't it? But that's kind of deliberate. I knew that was gonna to be too much. Yes, there's a reason why I've decided to go for the deep sea green today. Because I am wondering if you could get something fairly close to it. I've been wondering if you could get something fairly close to this color. If you mix the French Ultramarine with a PG-7 instead of the PG-18, which is what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. So today I'm very much recreating another super granulating color. But then tomorrow I'm kind of putting my own spin on it. And because I think, I mean in that swatch up there the Viridian is, is a bit weak. And phalo green is obviously going to be much more powerful. I don't know, is this fairly close already? It might be fairly close. This is too green, probably. It's certainly too dry. Oh, this is not much different. It's called deep sea green, so it should be leaning towards the green, obviously. I think this is fairly close. Might want to get this a bit more pigmented, and these two, I don't see it, that they are so much different. I don't know, this is going to be a lovely, lovely turquoise. I do really like this one as well. I'm gonna say, oh, this is probably fairly close. I'm gonna put a little swatch here and see. So I think maybe this is a little bit too green. So I don't Tiny little bit more of the ultramarina. But yes, but this one I'm really wondering how close of a match you can get with instead of going for the PG 18, which is probably a series three pigment. I'm not entirely sure. It's probably a, it's not of the one of the cheaper ones. So how well you could do if you replace the actual viridian with pg7 which in quite a lot of student grades and some other even artist grades is used as viridian so as like an ersatz viridian so to speak i'm wondering if i can get something that would come fairly close to this to these mixes and to the actual deep sea green with a pg7 and the PB27, Camper 29, oh, sorry. So that's what's gonna be happening tomorrow. Yeah, but I think in between these two, they get fairly close. You can see some nice granulation separating out, uh, how it's separating out there. It's maybe a bit greener than the swatch from the dot card, but not very much in this, certainly in this half of the swatch, these look fairly similar. 
yeah but that's a very lovely color so please give the video a like and do subscribe and come back tomorrow to see how my experiment with the pg7 goes and thank you very much for watching bye now bye